Hello and welcome to Frank's Summer School. Frank's Summer School. We're beyond 180 days. This is in the summer of 2014. Uh, and uh, summers are wild. Uh, you know, I, I understand why they don't even try, at least in the United States, they don't, or they don't try to have school in the summer. There's so much to do and so much going on. Uh, and that's the case here on the farm. Uh, I've got lots to show you, uh, uh, but I, I could, sort of took a little bit of a break. Uh, and I'm going to be laid back about this. Anyway, what you're going to see in the second video today is batch bug hen house. Now that word batch bug, I've made it up. I'll tell you something funny about it, actually. I made it up from building a cheap, cheap, but you good. Building a cheap but good hen house. Chicken coop, you would say probably in English, you might say that quicker. But uh, in German, it would be bauen eines uh, billiges, aber gutes Hühnerhaus, <laughs> which is also pretty s silly. Uh, you're going to see Shirley's work. Shirley, I talk about her all the time. I have for four years, three years maybe now. She's worked with me continually. You've seen her. Now you're going to see her work and to hear her voice. Uh, you're, we're, <clears throat> I'm going to send you off to Germany to see what she's doing. She is also uh, attempting to build something very cheap and very good. And she's German, and the Germans in general, they have that reputation, and I think they've earned it, that they do good work, very good work, much better work than I do, for example. Uh, and uh, she's, so far she doesn't have any money in this chicken house at all, uh, she got some things that were given to her, some doors and some blocks. And, and she'll explain about it in German. <clears throat> She's, her German is slow and clear, but it is German. But I think it's going to be worth your time to watch it. Uh, she isn't at this moment in real time. She's not finished. Uh, but she probably will be soon. That's something else. She is, is the type that's going to finish it. Uh, I'm, I'm building a cheap but good fireplace that I started almost a year ago or nine months ago and I'm still working on it and I'm putting it online and building a good but cheap Cooper shop something I started about two months ago I don't know when I'll finish it <clears throat> and yesterday my neighbor and I started building a good but uh, a butch bug building a cheap but good <clears throat> water wheel our first water wheel and so there are going to be a lot of things uh, that's going to be sort of a keyword oh I know what I was going to tell you that's kind of funny I used that word, and, and Shirley, she's quick on a computer, and she Googled it, you know, because here was an English word she didn't know. And she says, I don't know that word. I, I Googled it. It's not there. And I said, well, of course it's not there. I made it up. It's my word. Uh, and I said hen house because hooner house. Hooner house. I, elsewhere in the course, I talk about loving the German language. Well, here's what I mean. Hen, let's see, in Portuguese, that would be galinha. It has nothing to do with hen. Galinha, and let's see, house would be casa. Galinha casa. <laughs> that doesn't make much sense, but, but you can see how close the two words are, or languages are related. Well, um, I've probably gone on enough already. I hope my rags don't put you off, but it's summertime. Uh, and uh, I'll, I'll upload this, and, <clears throat> and then uh, you'll begin to see, uh, over the next several days, you'll see Shirley's... Uh, videos that she's putting together. So, bye for now.